Welcome to the third episode of Flipping Economics. In this episode, we will look at the second type of elasticity, income elasticity. Income elasticity. Income elasticity is the quantity demanded of a product depends on the income of the consumer. For example, if you earn a hundred thousand rand a month, you are more likely to shop at Willy's for food. You can afford buying a little bit more expensive products. If you earn thirty thousand rand a month, you are more likely to shop at Pick and Pay for food. If you earn 10,000 rand a month, you would rather buy a jean at Mr. Price as a guest jean at Stutterfits. You can't afford guests. The question is, by how much will the quantity demanded for certain goods change if there is a change in income? Income elasticity measures sensitivity of quantity demanded to changes in income. Therefore, the formula for income elasticity is the percentage change in quantity demanded divided by the percentage change in price. Remember to categorize your answer. So if you obtain a positive answer, you are dealing with a normal product. In more detail, if your answer is between the value of 0 and 1, you are dealing with an essential product like food and clothing. If your value is larger than 1, it is a luxury product. If you are dealing with a negative value, you are dealing with an inferior product, such as toilet paper. In the next episode, we will look at cross-price elasticity and price elasticity of supply.